man! The bucket had been further away, I would have scored! Bullseye! No bucket out there can escape me! Woohoo! I got it in! Oh, that's cheating, Alice, because you were closer! Not at all! I just aim better than you! Hey there, young ones! Are you training out here today to become sharpshooters? But I don't need any training! <laughs> <laughs> Even so, to be really good requires trying over and over again! Saying that, Tony Truck has organized a shooting competition, so it's your opportunity to test your skills. A shooting competition? Oh, yeah, uh -huh. let's do it. Okay, now everyone to truck control. Yippee! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Tony Truck competition is divided into several shooting stands, which will put you mini trucks to the test for precision. To take part, you will be equipped with the catapult module. Super! I just love catapults! I'm programming the launch pad to send you to the competition. It's up to you now. Yeah! Whoa. It's gonna be so great! Four, three, two, one. Mini truck, go! Hello, Tony Truck! I love your festival and what you've done for the competition! <laughs> Why, thanks, Alice. Chef Cookie gave me a hand in setting it up. Hello there, Mini Trucks! Now it's time to begin. You have one turn each and one turn on each stand. If you just hit the target, you'll score one point. And if you hit the target in the bowl, that means you get two points. Mm -hmm. With four points total, you will win a terrific prize. So mm -hmm. that means we need to make at least one perfect shot. Well calculated, Lisa. Okay, so the first part of the competition is to knock all the cones down. If you're able to do that successfully, you get two points. I will start. And... Got it! Wow, great shot. You got two points. Well done. My turn. I got a hit. That gives me one point. Ha! Five out of six. I nearly did it. Yep, but it's still just worth one point. Yeah, yeah, I know. Huh? Oops, I think that was too hard. Let's move on to the next part. For this challenge, you will need to jump on this ramp and shoot the target over there from the air. Now be careful, though. If you shoot from the ground, you'll get no points and will be disqualified from no. the competition. Let me oh. go first. Wow, wow, that was impressive. With my screen, I too shall get in the bowl. You'll see. Oh. Mm. Oh. Too bad, Alice. You concentrated too hard on the target, so you forgot to pay attention to the ramp. You score zero points. Now, who's next? <gasps> yeah! That is two points, and so you have yeah. won the chance to go get the target to put it back. Oh, it's not funny shooting too hard. You can go now, Lisa. <sighs> Just two more points, and it's a wrap. I'm in the lead with three points already. I'm just too good. <laughs> and for this final challenge, you must shoot very far this time. But remember to focus. You need strength as well as precision to win this challenge. This time, no mistake is allowed. You can do it, Alice. All right. If I hit the center, that means I beat Alice. Oh, now we're even. I guess that's good. My turn. Jeremy, you'll shoot last mm -hmm. just in case you break the target mm -hmm. again. Go, Lisa. You're the best shot. Hm. Awesome. Yeah. Your turn, Jeremy. We're counting Whoa. on you to succeed. Wow. wow. Yippee. Well done, well done. With four points each, you can all have a cuddly toy in the color of your choice. So go ahead and pick one for your prize. What a victory! I have made a special cake to celebrate. You do huh? really like cake, Chef Cookie. Grandpa Ted! I'm so proud of you, Mini Trucks. Everyone here is a winner, and you all cheered each other along at crucial moments. For your teamwork, you all deserve the Shark yeah. Shooter's Cup. Jeremy, you must not aim at these cups since you might just break them. But only if he touches them. <laughs> <laughs>
I'd so love to do rock climbing. It's the hardest sport in the world. There's no way that's true. Tennis is the hardest because you need endurance. No way. I think karate is the hardest sport. Hiya! Well, I think it's surfing because the waves are scary and also there are fish in the sea. Hello there, mini trucks. Grandpa Ted, tell us which sport you think is the hardest in the world. Hmm. Well, there is a sport that requires balance, strength, speed, and precision. It is also quite beautiful to watch. It has to be ice hockey, no question. If you feel like having a go at it, then follow me over to truck control. Super! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> has recently turned the frozen lake into an ice hockey rink. She is setting you up with a challenge that might even surprise you. I'm sure it won't be that difficult for us. <laughs> You'll soon find out. You're all going to be equipped with helmets and ice skates. I'm programming the launch pad to send you over to Zoe right this minute. Now let's go! Show me what you got. We're just as able to score, too. Huh. Here! It's yours! Ha! And goal! Oh, no, I missed! Ouch! I've got it! Bravo! That was the last move in the allotted time for you. You are both tied at one. We'll try and play you in the final face-off. This is the decisive moment! We'll see who's really the best. Come on, Alex! You can do it, Alice! Yeah! Ah! Oh. Uh, oh. Uh. Wait, did you see that? It just broke in two pieces! Does that mean there's a goal for each team? Wow, now that's the first time I've watched a game with so much style. I have no choice but to declare you all the winners. We are just too good! I must say, each one of you has been extraordinary. You've just needed one single game to master the techniques of ice hockey. Goodness, you'll never cease to amaze us. Yes, you definitely deserve the Hockey Championship Stanley Cup. We mustn't break this one in two, right, Alex?
here, Alex. I've just found a real dinosaur fossil. You found a fossil, Jeremy? Oh, how lovely. Oh, no. I think it's actually just a small snail shell. Oh. And to think I wanted to become an archaeologist. Archaeo what? An archaeologist is a person whose job it is to find fossils and all sorts of other prehistoric antiquities. Wow! If you would like to find real prehistoric treasures, then all of you follow me to truck control. Yippee! Yeah! Kim, the scientist, has set up her excavation on Claw Island, and she will be needing some reinforcements to help her out. But be warned, Mini Truck, you must be as observant as eagles and work as hard and thoroughly as little mice. You can count on us, Grandpa Ted! Alex and Jeremy, you are going to get yourselves completely equipped with digging modules. While well, Lisa and Alice are going to be equipped with claw modules to pick up your different finds with care. Yippee! I'm programming the launch pad to send you over to the island. Ah. Godspeed to you, mini trucks! Are you coming to lend me a hand? Yep. Where would you like us to dig? I've already prepared two areas for excavating. Here in the middle of the island and over there near the cliff. Come on, Lisa. We should go to the one near the cliff. Okay, then. Alice and I will search in the middle of the island. And remember to be very thorough when you are digging. Yes, just like little mice. <laughs> With this module, I'll bet I could dig through to the other end of the earth in no time. There! I can see something! Oh, but that's not a fossil, though, is it? It looks like a plastic watering can. Yes, it's a plastic watering can. Did you know that when plastic objects are thrown out into nature, it can take several thousands of years for it to disappear? Oh, I'll just put it to one side for recycling, then. Look, right there. It's a fossil. Okay, I'll go get it. Wow, wow that's, that's so cool. cool. Wow! There must be even more near it! We're yeah. coming to help! <laughs> Hi there, Mini Trucks! At the rate you're going, you might damage the fossils. Take your time, huh? and more importantly, be very attentive. Sure, you got it! Come on, Jeremy! Let's carry on with our digging! That way, Alice and Lisa will be able to pick up more fossils! Let's do this! Here, I got one! And here, another one! And here, too! Come on, let's keep it up! There's more right here! <sighs> oh no, that's a lot of fossils! What are we gonna do with them? From what I can see, all these pieces are part of the same fossil. We must put them together now. It's kind of like a puzzle, then. Okay, I'm going to solve this with my digital windshield. Alex, that one goes right there. Jeremy, you can put that one here. That's right. Alice, you can put it there. Wow, we've nearly finished. There we go. Why, you found a fossil velociraptor. Did you know that these dinosaurs even had feathers? In fact, they are the ancestors of birds. So cool! Whoa! This is very impressive. You have reconstructed an entire dinosaur as a team today. That's because they have been thoroughly working hard as a team. Bravo, Mini Trucks. For your work, you have earned the Archaeologist Trophy. Yeah! Well, I'm going to bury my trophy so someone can find it in a thousand years! <laughs>
Hello there, mini trucks. That ball you have there looks brand new. Yes, we've just painted it. Well, good job, mini trucks. Come to think of it, I know exactly who would need your painting skills. Let's go and I will explain everything at truck control. Yahoo! Yeah! Mini trucks. Today, Amy the mechanic is doing her paint rounds and will need some help. I thought the four of you would be perfect. She's painting what exactly? She goes around and collects old objects and gives them a facelift by giving them a touch of paint. Oh, like we did with the ball? Exactly right. I will equip you with the paint modules and program the launch pad to send you off right away to a workshop. And we have a mission for the mini trucks. Yay! Yay! Four, three, two, one, mini truck, go! Hello, Amy! Hello there, mini trucks. Are you ready to give a new look to old things? Yes! Well, it's actually called restoration. What is this here? <laughs> That's an elevator bridge. We're going to take it with us. You will quickly understand what it's used for. Our first client of the day is at the restaurant. Chef Cookie! Hello, Chef Cookie. How are you and what can we do for you today? Look at my old cauldron. It's lost all its color. Do you think you can do something to it? If you look carefully, there's a bit of old color left behind. That's right, and it's yellow. Sounds like a mission for me! Okay, here we go for a good dose of yellow. Oh, my, 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 it looks brand new. I didn't expect that. Thank you, Lisa. And one satisfied customer, huh? Who's our next customer, oh. Amy? Zoe the coach. So it's off we go to the sports field. Woohoo! Hello, Zoe. And how can we be of assistance today? I have this old radio that I love to fit. It works really well, but no longer looks as nice. So then, Mini Trucks, who's going to paint this radio? I think this radio used to be green. Woohoo! Okay, here goes! Intense green! Yeah, that's it! Wow! Thank you, Alice! My radio looks 20 years younger! Mission accomplished! Bravo, Mini Trucks! Just one more customer on our list. <sighs> However, I have a feeling this one might be a bit more complicated. Yeah, no worries! <laughs> Sam the Pirate! Hello there, Mini Trucks! Sam, you're our last customer! So what can we do for you? I would like for my old treasure chest to look as good as new and have that sparkle back. Do you think you can help me out? Oh, but it's purple. What should we do? We don't have that shade. According to my digital windshield, it would be possible to make purple by mixing two colors. Oh, yeah? Which ones? Too bad it doesn't say, so I think we're going to have to think for ourselves. Alex, so how about we try with ours? A bit of yellow. And a bit of red to just mix with it. You know that yellow and red make orange? Yeah, it's nice, but it's not purple. Lisa, how about we try? First off, a bit of blue. And a bit of yellow. Look, that makes green. That's my color, but still no purple. Alex and Jeremy, I'm thinking the two of you should give it a try. That's it. I'm glad you figured it out. You made purple. To make it, you need to mix blue with red. Yes, we did it! So now I just need to paint the chest. Hey there, mini trucks. How did your painting challenge go? They're just like professionals. My old chest is as good as new. For your hard work, you deserve the Restoration Painter's Cup. Woo! Hey, if you ask me, I think this cup could use a little touch of paint. <laughs>
our defender is getting dangerously close to the goal. Alex, give me the ball. And he strikes the ball with such a sweet move. Oh, yeah, it's a goal. Wait, what? That was too high. Alex, you could have passed it to me. You're playing solo, and it's just not fun. Perhaps, but I never miss a goal. Yeah, you play as if we weren't there. Whoops. I didn't even see you there, Jeremy. I'm sorry. You know, Alex, truck soccer's really a team game. Yeah, but I'm better when I play solo. Well, in that case, I believe I have a challenge for you, mini trucks. Now let's go to truck control. Dear mini trucks, your mission today will be to strike a goal against the incredible coach Zoe. <laughs> Striking a goal? Too easy. <laughs> a physical strike alone will not be sufficient, my dear Alex. Zoe is waiting for you now. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go! Four, three, two, one! Mini trucks, go! Mini trucks, ready to let off steam? But I'm not heating anything. <laughs> I was talking about letting off some excess energy, Alice. Here is the ball. To win the game, you just need to strike a goal by following the classic rules of truck soccer. Oh, we're really good at truck soccer. You'll see. And we're off. I'm so good, this will be done in just a few seconds. The amazing Alice is master of the kick. And just like that, you missed. But I couldn't even kick it. That's because you haven't even tried to avoid Zoe. By making zigzags along the way with the ball, it will work. The goal is mine! Go on, strike! Oh. You missed again. <laughs> Try not to despair, Mini Truck. It's my huh? turn! Hmm? Alice, you're not allowed to shoot from your position. You're outside the limits of the pitch. If you don't go by the rules, your goal will not count. Oh, but I haven't even scored a goal. I have an idea. Lisa, follow me. And we're off. Your goal, Jeremy. <gasps> oh. Oh no, we nearly had it! Well done, Jeremy. That was a good strategy. You have to practice making passes and you will succeed. I know how to help you. I'm going to try and take the ball from you. To stop me, you must make several passes before I arrive. Understood! Are you ready? Yeah! Throw me the ball! Woohoo! Pass it to me! Pass it to me! Huh. And there! Huh? Jeremy, it's mm -hmm. yours! Look, I did it! Whew, it didn't pass too far! Bravo, many trucks! You've mastered the game by playing as a team. So why don't you try to strike a goal by using what you've just learned? Yeah! yeah. Watch out, because things are getting tough! We'll see how much power you've got now. Over to you, Jeremy! To you, Alex! This time, we're playing as a team. Lisa! Thanks to my special glasses, I really can't miss this goal. Goal! Oh. 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 Right in! Thank you, Alex. No problem, Lisa. We make a really great team. Well done, Mini Trucks. I always knew you could do it. That was an incredible goal, Mini Trucks. I can see that Zoe has turned you into really good soccer truck players. More than that, I turned them into a real team, closely knit and efficient. Well, in that case, you have especially earned the lucky cup that's given for Soccer Cup. Hooray! Yippee! They're so pretty, these cups! On the other hand, you must make passes with them or you just might break them. <laughs> <laughs>
work is now done! Hi there, mini trucks! And what are you doing? We're just tidying up! After last night's hurricane, the yard is such a huge mess as you can see! <laughs> Making a pile is not exactly the best method for tidying up! I have the perfect mission for you! Everyone to truck control! Dear Mini Trucks, as you know, the hurricane has affected the whole area of Truckville, and Amy, the mechanic's workshop, has been turned upside down. Oh no, but what is she gonna do for her clients who need her? Exactly. You are going to help clear up all the tools that have been thrown around by the hurricane. So then, I will equip you with the mechanical arm modules and send you off to her workshop. Woohoo! Okay, so here we go to Amy's rescue! Are you ready, Mini Trucks? Yes! Four, three, two, one, mini trucks, go! Oh, oh, wow. Wow. Hello there, mini trucks. Hello, Amy. Oh, it's so true that the hurricane has really messed up all your tools. Yes, I know. And my next client arrives in ten minutes. I can't have them come to my workshop with this mess. Are you ready to help me tidy it up? Yes! <laughs> no, not like that, Alice. So that I can work properly, all my tools must be in their respective storing place. This box contains screwdrivers, this one contains hammers, and this one nuts and bolts. Oh. Now your turn. Okay, let's do this! Screwdriver! Oh. Come on, come on! Hey! Come on, quickly! We must go faster! But the first client is going to arrive soon! Fast, fast, fast! Stop! Alex, but the tools were put in all the wrong places! Amy said it was important for her work that all the tools should be put in their proper places! Oh no! to redo it all. But we're never gonna finish on time. I might just have a plan, but we must work together as a team. Okay, this is what we're gonna do, guys. Is everyone in place? Yup. Me too. I'm ready. Amy, how much longer do we have? 20 seconds. Okay, mini trucks, go! Hammers and nuts, screwdrivers, screwdrivers, more nuts, hammers, Screwdrivers, hammers, and nuts. And nuts, more nuts. Screwdrivers, hammers. Come on, you all, we must hurry up. Now watch out, mini trucks. Quick, Jeremy. Quick. Five, hammer, screwdriver, four. And nuts, three. Hammer, two, screwdriver, one. All finished. Yay, all, all finished. finished. Wow! It's all put away! We make such a great team! Yep, that's for sure. Thank you. My workshop is now perfectly tidy. That was close! Here's the first client! Grandpa's head! Wow! Hey, mini trucks! I say this is some great tidying up you've done here! I could not have done better. I'm so proud of you. And because of your work, you deserve the spring clean cup. We will need to put this one away. <laughs>